Hey guys, and welcome back to Daily Duel. So, yes, Hermit Yokai is the new deck that shall be played on here. So, I hope that you guys are looking forward to it. I know I am. So, I don't really know how to play this deck. <laughs> uh, I got the Blox Monster, I got this guy. This card is almost summoned to defense version. Your opponent cannot target Hermit Yokai for attack except for this one. It's a nice 21 booty. Don't mind that. So, uh, I guess I'll just set him, really. I'm, just, I'm not going to activate him. Uh, yeah. If I get another one, I can pen I can put him in the pendulum zone. I need some Hermit Yokais right now. You know what? I'm taking Dulsla. I'm just going to set the break your skill in the morning take the Dulsla. Not really in a hurry to do much of anything. So yes, Hermit Yokai is the deck that will be replacing my mills on Wednesdays now. And I must tell you, this deck is pretty dirty. Pretty dirty. You know, I, I put it together with, with the full on intent of being a jerk with this deck. So, uh, uh, be prepared to see some jerkiness, because that's just, that's one of the things that I definitely want to try out. Alright, so really, I just need the other, the other Pendulum Monster, but there's other Hermit Yokai's I would love to get, I just, I need to get them, of course, so. <sighs> so I'm cool, and that's not hold death button, there's nothing I want to be played right now. So something, Mizuki, something zombie related. Another breakthrough skill, okay. Well, thank you, I guess. Yeah, Depro, thank you. Uh, right now, it's not the best of cards. So, once again, I'll keep just taking the duel slow for right now. <sighs> so, as you can tell by the title of the video, definitely got something to talk about. Definitely. Zombie Master. Okay. Like I said, something zombie, um, zombie related, which is fine. Alright, definitely I should have set this guy, but I thought maybe I could get something, so memo to myself, just set this guy. Next time, like I said, I don't know, really know how to play this deck 100%, but... Yeah, set this guy. Definitely set this guy. You gonna overlay those two? Yes you are, until the wall will change. Yes you are. <sighs> I don't like the idea of putting Mizuki in the graveyard just as much as the next person, but it's fun. Yeah, can I draw a Hermit Yokai monster? No, I can't. Okay. Oh, well, this is pretty good for his first fucking duel. Just me being fucking terrible with this deck because I'm not getting anything that I need. Like, hello? <sighs> At least you have a nice 21 booty, so maybe that'll, maybe that'll last long enough. I should have set you a long time ago, but kind of hesitant to do it, because I thought maybe I can get, you know, the other pendulum scale and pendulum summon this guy, and he would just be awesome. Mm-hmm. Mizuki. Banish summon zombie master. That's fine. Then we use your effect. I'm gonna break to scale you. Oh no, no, you're not gonna do that, because you have to have something in the graveyard, preemptively. Alright, so you're gonna shuffle the Mizuki back. And then XC into another little wobble chain. I don't know. <sighs> yep, another little wobble chain. No. It's fine. Definitely no. I don't need you doing that. I don't need you getting set up in your grave. No, thank you. You got the wire top? Book a moon. That works. Can't think it's a fight something that's face down like that, so. That works. It totally works. That's a, that was a smart make one. The next one! Those are a smart one. That's how I need my Hermit Yokai monsters. Once I get them, we could get this duel started. But really, until I get them. I thought I ran enough monsters to keep it consistent. You know, not, there's background here, but they ain't too much, so. That's irritating. 
No, it's fine. Are you gonna make Goyo Guardian? That's gonna suck too. I'm pretty much gonna be top decking at that point. Well, that's fine as well. You might actually have this, because I got like nothing right now. I am not trying to take anything that will allow me to play. I'm not trying to take any of my Hermit Yokai's. Oh, okay. No, that's fine. <sighs> that sucks, but it's fine. Really crossing my fingers and hoping for one of my Hermit Yokai's now. Definitely, because right now it's not looking too hot. Bottomless. You would have. Dan, mm, thank you. You would have been great fucking last turn. Last turn. Thank you. Alright, lost the first fucking duel with Hermit Yokai. Alright, this is awesome. Bear back. Alright, let's try this again. I changed the deck a lot. So let's try this version, because it's pretty much version 2.0. That was just good. That was just. Wow. Uh, that was just some straight ass. So let's go ahead and try this again. It's better. It's much better. Actually, I, I could actually do some of these plays, so. Just set the road, Cree. Yeah, yeah, you have a nice 21 booty. So I'll go ahead and text you. Anyway, like I said, you can tell by the title. It's interesting something to talk about, so let me go ahead and tell you about my day, which will lead up into what I want to talk about today. So. <sighs> oh. I don't want to do a mirror match. Be right back. All right, let's try this again. I so I don't care if you go first or I go first. Hmm. Not terrible. This card, uh, this card, really, much of a hand, except for, but how do I don't have anything else to summon, do I? Okay, I guess. Let's say I don't have anything else to summon, do I? You're gonna affect really me when I didn't even have anything else to summon. That's cool. Maybe that that affect me like a fucking boss, though. All right. Oh, I control. Returns to my hand. Okay. Oh, but I won't be returning to the hand because my effects is negated. Ah. I get you. That sucks. Eh, that's cool. I just wanted to do so. I can't. My effects negated. I don't return to the hand. The snuggles. The snuggles are real. That sucks. Totally wanted to return to the hand. I guess it's fine. Oh my god. What's up with everybody using Synchro decks? Oh my god. Glow well, Bulb gets unbanned, and now everybody and their mother is on fucking synchro decks. Like, that's literally all I've been facing lately. And seeing other people, when I watch other people duel, that's all they face is synchro decks. And I at least not have to worry about back row. God. You know, some of the battle favor. Okay. I didn't even know you can normal summon battle favor. Ugh. Anyway. Uh, let me go ahead and talk about my Tuesday. So Tuesdays, I have, uh, of women's studies, and I have calculus. So, uh... Hmm. Hmm. Well, that's irritating. So, uh, yeah, he has a Quasar. He has fucking first turn Quasar. Well, not first turn Quasar, but he has fucking Quasar. You can just ban it, and you can just summon that, which is level 1. Summon that. That's 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. There's fucking Quasar right there. Oh, my God. Oh, didn't expect to get first. I didn't expect to get That's the second time I've got Quasar today. I got Quasar on Vitamin 1, I get Quasar in Daily Duels! Look, what the fuck? Why do I keep getting goddamn Quasar? 
Like, hello? Yep, here comes Quasar. That's fun to deal with all the fucking time. I got nothing for Quasar right now. I wish I could activate something to bait it out, then creature swap it. I would love to do that, but I gotta have a creature to creature swap first. All right now, shit is just not going my way. Definitely not going my way. Quasar, I know. Quasar's getting way too fucking easy to make lately. Like, it used to be fucking cool when you brought it out. Now I see it all the fucking time. All the fucking time. So, glow up bulb, uh, what else? You got glow up bulb, you got the one for one. Lots of one cards, like usual. Uh, so I don't know how much I gotta preach that till people get into their fucking thick ass heads that it's a fucking number generator. Up, oh, I lose. Let's just go ahead and synchro summon to something stronger than this. And then fucking whoop my ass. Sure. All you have to do is just run over me with that. And then just fucking attack me. Twice with Quasar. So, that's fun. Everybody making fucking Quasar. Look what the fuck. What the hell is going on lately? Go up by 800, I go up to what, 23? Go ahead and negate Quasar. Negate Quasar. Ah, oh, this would be nice, but won't be enough, clearly. Oh my god, what's up with everybody using fucking Quasar? Yep, I lose. Again? Surprise, surprise. What the fuck is going on? Ah, oh, bear back again. Alright, let's try this again. Not looking too good right now. Definitely not. Stop drawing you, I swear. You made me block one. I'm drawing you all the fucking time. I think about taking you out. Swear to God, I am. Look, you're not, you're not doing shit. I'm gonna pendulum summon you. I keep fucking drawing you. Like every hand, I keep drawing you. Every fucking hand. Hello? That's fine. Ugh. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna take you out. I'm gonna take you out, definitely. You're out. You're out. You're out of your own deck. That's sad. You're out of your own fucking deck. I'd rather run Fire Fist over you. That's pretty sad, isn't it? That you're getting taken out of your own fucking deck. Own fucking deck taking you out. That's sad. Super sad. Really? I can run other shit besides you. I thought, I thought you were interesting, and now, now, no. You're clogging the fuck out of me. Clogging the fuck out of me. I'll run other shit. Take you out, take the pendulums out, and I'll just run the three koala bears or whatever they are. Fucking tanky. That's what I need up in this bitch. Like, I don't like you. I don't like the pendulums. Really?
I like you. I don't like you. I don't like you. <laughs> You're gonna take your bell and ram it into me. No? Nothing happens. Really? Using your bell against me? <laughs> Out of all the people to use your bell against. Me. Me. Alright. Interesting. I'm guessing one of those face downs is limit reverse, so I know exactly when to pop that in the face, so interesting. Using your bell against me. Why would you drop Terra if you're just planning on summoning it, uh, summoning it later? I would've dropped Ultimate, or something else in the deck. Montage Dragon version. Don't trip your armor again, Knight. Uh, anyway. Uh, women's Studies. Let me talk about Women's Studies. So, Women's Studies was the usual bleh. Now we're talking about media. And how women are, just, uh, you know, setting standards for women in media. Blah 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 blah. blah. Who cares? Blah. All right, you know what? I... <laughs> you want to get taken the fuck out, don't you? If you guys are beast warriors, but you're rock, so you guys want to get taken out the fucking deck so fucking fast. I'll, I'm glad to do it. I'm glad to do it. Clearly, you're not working, so. Actually, you know what? No, I want Wolf Park. I'm spell trapper monster attack is activated while you control and all the face up monsters you control, if any are. Oh my god, but it's not. I bear. 25. Freaking scary though. Like, whoo. But no. All the monsters in my field are not Hermit Yokai, so. Yeah, I don't like you. <laughs> Clearly, I don't like you. You are all up in my grill. All up in my grill. Can't even summon you. I don't like you. I don't like you at all. So, you're out. You're out. I'll just run more back rail and more beast warriors. Of course I'm not going to throw the fucking chair at you, Bell. It's dumb. Of course I'm not going to do that, so. Nor do I feel like making... Castell or anything to spin it back at this current moment. So, really, I'll just leave it alone. I'm taking all this out. All of it out. All of it. All of it to get the fuck out of my deck. All of it. Ah, <sighs> yeah. Anyway, uh, Kirby Girl didn't show up to, uh, class today, so. I had no friends in that class today. Really, I, overall, I really don't have any friends at college, so. That's why I really don't enjoy college that much, really, because I don't have any friends. No, there's classmates, but friends, no. So, that sucks, it really does. What are you gonna summon, you Bell? Ooh, you can summon a. F no, you're just gonna quit. I'm not getting another going. I'm just gonna finish talking. My show's coming on anyway. So let me just go ahead and finish talking. So yeah, and that, and that, and, that, and that's why it's uh, I, that's why I titled. That's one of the reasons why I titled that because I don't have any friends at college. You know, I I don't have friends who care about me and want to commit to a relationship. N not like that with me though. You know, generally when you have friends, you know, they say hi to you. You say hi to them. You talk. You associate friends. These people, they're just classmates. And if I don't put up the effort to communicate with them, they will not put up the effort to communicate with me. And that's not something friends do. You know, with a friend relationship, majority of the time, it's 50-50. But when I'm trying to, you know, get to know these people and try to be friends with these people, and I'm putting up all this effort, and, they want, and they're putting out no effort, then it's clearly, it means that we are not friends. 
So, Kirby girl, she didn't show up. I didn't have anybody to talk to, no friends. When the study went like one of the studies, blah, bland, boring, whatever. Uh, there's really not much to say about that class. Like I said, it's, it's kind of boring. I don't, I don't like that class. Unlike any of my classes, I don't like college at, this semester at all. I don't like my life, really. <sighs> the only thing that gives me meaning and purpose is really the YouTube channel. Yeah. The only thing that keeps me going is to create YouTube videos for you guys. If I didn't do that, then there really would be no point for me to live. Hmm. Anyway, I'll go to calculus class. So, of course, this is the next class after um, calculus girl said that she doesn't want to date. Correct? But then when I really sat down and I thought about it, we're not friends. We're not friends. We're just classmates. And I, I didn't want to be like negative and stuff, but when I really sat down and thought about it, we're not friends. Because she doesn't treat me like a friend, you know? If she, if she really wanted to be my friend, she would go out of her way, out of her way to talk to me, to get to know me, to acknowledge my existence. But she fucking doesn't. No one does because apparently I don't fucking exist. Unless I ex explicitly put myself out there to... People know, like, hey, I exist, they will acknowledge my assistance. I don't think anybody says hi or good morning or how are you doing, Daniel. No one. No one does. <sighs> so, yeah, went to class with in calculus, calculus girl, calculus. I'm not doing the math homework, I swear. That math homework is way too much work. It has graphing and just has water, just algebra and cleanup work, so fuck it. We get to miss three assignments, that's gonna be one of them. Uh, I spent half the class doing in different in, in, impli no. Is it implicit differentiation? I don't know, I don't know how to pronounce this shit. Did half the class in that, and then half the class we did review for an upcoming exam we have in calculus. Whatever. So of course calculus calculus girl was there, of course. Um, and like I said, that's what I said. Think about it. If me and calculus girl were friends, I'm not even saying, you know, potential dating material friends don't you think that when she came in the class she saw me she would say hi daniel or something like that acknowledge my existence she didn't fucking talk to me she had nothing to say to me because and i think when i sat down and i thought about it i always put up the, the effort i always said hi to her i always walked her to her car i always talked to her she never put up the effort to even talk to me she would never text me or get in contact with me unless it had to do something with calculus. And then when I always tried to step out of the boundaries and talk about something not calculus related, she had wanted nothing to do with it. Therefore, implying that she is not my friend and just another fucking classmate. It doesn't have to be me that she has to get help from or cheat off of or whatever. When she doesn't cheat off me, but get help from. It doesn't have to be me. There's nothing special about me. Because in her mind, Anybody who does well in calculus can help her. So it had nothing to do with me, and I am not valid in her world. Therefore, I am not her friend. Alright? I have friends. I exist in their life. I am part of their life. But her, I'm not. I'm clearly not. I'm clearly not part of her life. And whether I would live or die tomorrow would not phase her existence at all. If my friends... My friends, if I died tomorrow, my friends would know and they would be phased or affected by the fact that I died. Her? No. She would go on living her life. She'd probably say, Daniel who? Really? No. So, of course, before you can, of course, be someone in a relationship with someone, be someone's boyfriend, you gotta be their friend first. So, that's probably it. She probably rejected me because... I'm not even her friend. I wasn't even her friend. I thought I was her friend, and that was goes for a lot of these girls, really. A lot of these girls this semester. I think I'm their friend. I think I'm getting to know them, but really, I'm nothing to them, and they're just trying to be nice, and they're just talking to me because they don't want to seem rude or, or like a bitch. But, you know, when you, when you figure them out, and you apply logic to their emotions, and you figure this shit out, then it all makes sense. It really does. So, like I said, if she wants nothing to do with me, fine, cool, whatever. I wanted nothing to do with you either. I thought maybe we were cool. I thought we were friends, but apparently we're not. You know? So, usually, class would end and, you know, I thought we were leaving the class together, but apparently, no. I was just bothering her and following her. So, of course, 
you know, a friend would, you know, want to spend time with other friends in the little time that we would get together, a friend would actually go ahead and, you know, leave with me, correct? Because we're friends. We, we go together because we're friends, correct? She gets up and walks out, doesn't even look at me, doesn't glance at me, doesn't say hello to me, nothing. I don't fucking exist. And it's not the first girl who's done it this semester. It's almost all of them, really. Almost all of them. I don't fucking exist, apparently. Apparently, I'm Casper the motherfucking ghost up in here. I did not know that. So, like I said, if I didn't have this YouTube channel, I would just be another nobody. So, I guess I, I thank you guys for acknowledging my existence, really. Thank you. I really do appreciate you guys. You guys are the only thing that are keeping me going each day. Because I really do. I hate my life. I hate my life. I'm very unhappy. But, that's another thing. Sorry, I didn't mean to go on that rant there, but seriously, it just, I'm tired. I'm tired of it. I'm tired of being a nobody. I'm tired of putting so much fucking effort for nothing. It has nothing to not have, with not having a girlfriend or not being, it has the fact that no one wants to, wants me to exist. Like I said, if I were to die tomorrow, a lot of people wouldn't even be faced. A lot of people. I don't mean to get so depressing or so deep, but seriously, I mean, like, really? So, I guess, once again, I'm done. I'm done. I'm tired. I'm tired. I don't, I don't, I don't really have any goals or dreams or, or ambitions, really. Really, I don't even care if I die. If I were to die tomorrow, I wouldn't care. So... Just another classmate. I'm just another blank face in the class. Another person who you sit next to for a couple of weeks and then class ends and you never see them again. And I want relationships more than that, but apparently I can't get them. So, oh well. All right, so clearly I need to fix this deck. This, all of this right here, this, this is coming out. This is coming out. I thought, I thought this was a pendulum based deck of interestingness, but no, it's not, so take this out and I'll probably just put the back row back in because I have this which is kind of like a solemn judgment I have this which is because of my monster the beast warrior and the bears with the wolf bark you know it's another beast warrior based deck which is fine I don't mind that but this this is not working this this right here pendulum this no not working especially drawing all three of them like hello those are just dead draws because I can't fucking summon them shit that's like drawing you bell which is funny because it's level 10 so it's just like drawing you bell so no. I'm taking that out. I'll just make it a Beast Warrior deck. Anyway. Uh, I didn't mean to get so deep on you guys. I know you guys came here to watch some interesting duels and be entertained. But I had to break it down. So I apologize. Anyway. Uh, I'll try to keep it. Try to keep it PG next time. So. Despite that. I hope that you guys enjoyed this. Please support this deck. Like I said. If you guys have any suggestions for this deck. Please shirt. Sure be sure to go ahead and comment them in the comment section below. But like I said, this, I don't like this. I don't like this. I thought, I was like, ooh, interesting with no pendulums. Okay, let's go ahead and try that. And then they clogged the shit out of me. Literally clogged the loving fuck out of me. You know? So, yeah. First duel, I I had this deck with the pendulum. Uh, I had some background. I didn't have the bears and the wolf box yet. I didn't put that until the second duel against the, the, uh, the synchro guy who made the quasar on me. The bears and the wolf box. Um... And really, the only trap cards I have in here are Horn. Uh, in that duel, and then the other duel, I had the Royal Decree, but then I took out the Royal Decree because then I was like, well, I have, what's the point in having Secret and Royal Decree? Because if I get the Royal Decree, then it's dead, and I, especially since I'm not going to search for this. You know? So I was like, okay, well, and I'll put the Horn and Phantom Beast back, and then that's how we got to this. But these are coming out. I'll, it's a, that's what? Uh, nine cards? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, nine cards. Nine cards. So I can I can put back in my Bottomless, my Warning, my Compulse. You know, I can put in Regeki, I can put in a whole bunch of things. I can put in more Beast Warriors, I can put whatever the fuck I want, so. Yep, you're gonna be doing that, so, yeah. Anyway, uh, like I said, I, I apologize, I apologize. Tried to make this entertaining, and in the end, it really wasn't. Anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and call it so, so. Thanks for watching, thanks for all the support, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Uh, tagging with Tiago using Pendulum Chaos Dragon.